Did you know in the field of psychology, the law of similarity plays an important part in how we view and understand the world? Humans tend to group similar things. In Gestalt, similar elements are visually grouped regardless of their proximity to each other. They can be arranged according to shape, size or color. Studies show that approximately 70% of individuals show a preference for grouping similar shapes or colors. Whether it's recognizing patterns in nature, organizing data sets or arranging items in our environment, the law of similarity plays a vital role in shaping our perceptions and behaviors. Let's explore how the law of similarity influences our perceptions and understanding the world. But before we do that, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for IntelliPath's YouTube channel. The law of similarity. The principle of similarity is a Gestalt principle. In other words, it describes how people visually perceive the world. The human eye tends to perceive similar elements in a design as a complete picture, shape, or group, even if those elements are separated. The brain seems to craft a link between elements of a similar nature. Then we can perceive them in a relationship with each other, separating them from other elements in a design. The characteristics that items share could be color, shape, size, font, orientation, or even movement. It just has to be a visual trait. Let's look at these three traits. First, we have the law of similarity based on shape. Then we have the law of similarity based on size. As you can see, we have bigger circle and smaller circles. Next, we have the law of similarity based on color. So as you can see, we have two different colors over here. The brain then spends time and effort trying to make a connection between items that are highly similar to one another to attempt to understand the relationship. This happens when you combine objects that are highly distinct from one another. Now let's take a look at some shapes to see how the principle of similarity applies to these traits. When you see these shapes on the screen, when you see these shapes on the screen, you're interpreting them as five distinct columns instead of three distinct rows. That's likely because each column has a common shape, all the circles, all the triangles, while each row does not. But let's add some color to see if your perception changes. When I add the green color in the middle row, I'm introducing another visual trait into this example. Color tends to be more powerful than the other visual traits, so you might now perceive this as three rows instead of five columns because of the color similarity overriding the shape similarity. Now, even if I randomly put the green color anywhere, your eye will still likely process the green shape as a grouping. In interface design, a shared color is often used to communicate a common functionality. Let's take another example. At first glance, you can't identify what is a text field and what is a button field because everything is of the same shape, size and color. But in this example, you can identify what is a text field and what is a button field because the color is a factor that differentiates the button from a text field and makes it easy to identify what is the call to action here. Now let's take a look at a real example. Here you can easily identify what is a text field, what is a button and what is a link. So everything is different from each other in terms of shape, color and size. Throughout your design, it's important to intentionally and consistently apply visual similarity signifiers like color, size, shape. That way, people can easily understand what content is related and which element in your design are interactive. With that said, we have reached the end of our video on the law of similarity. If this video was helpful, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for IntelliPath's YouTube channel. Just a quick info guys, IntelliPath offers UI UX course in collaboration with iHub Divya Sampark, IIT Roorkee. Through this course, you will learn complete UI UX design thinking, interaction designs, wireframing, and guerrilla testing for a rewarding UI UX design career. This UI UX design course will be taught by IIT faculty and industry experts. With this course, we have already helped thousands of professionals in successful career transition. You can check out their testimonials on our Achievers channel whose link is given in the description below. Without a doubt, this course can set your career to new heights. So visit the course page link given below in the description and take a first step towards the career growth in the field of UI UX design.